Alright mates, it's one of the sunniest days this year and I'm out and about. Now that was the Tarzan Call Challenge and uh, that was my offering. There's so many challenges going on at the moment. I think I'll maybe start one myself and that is it. Basically you've got to do a Tarzan Call. I just done one just now, it was pretty good actually. So I'll just do another one, just to prove it's me. <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah. Now I nominate Moto Carry and Lens Gapoff and Old Man Tony. Go for it guys, let me hear your uh, Tarzan calls. What a cracking day, it is absolutely... <clears throat> so, we're off for a wee ride, you'll find out in a tick where we're going. Fade to next scene. What a magnificent place <laughs> to find yourself. I'll tell you what, you missed a, a really good laugh there. I was, <laughs> I was coming down this road. I was coming around that corner and then I thought, oh look, there's a, <laughs> a nice bit to uh, pull in and maybe take some photographs and do some chatting. <laughs> but I was going a little bit too fast and ended up coming this way. Saw the gravel, shit myself. <laughs> Avoided that pothole, went over this grass, and then on to here, <laughs> all the time breaking, uh, and then headed straight for these two potholes, and eventually parked Brutus there, <laughs> and all the time I was thinking, shit, my camera's not on to capture this, because <laughs> it was quite funny, anyway, we're all on, uh, we're all safe, we're still paint side up, or whatever they call it, <laughs> rubber side down, whatever. Using these gloves today, Icon, uh, Icon Pursuit, 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 they are fantastic for today, they're sort of women's gloves, they're, they're perforated, I don't know if you can see that, but yeah, you can, like tea bags, you can see right through them. Fantastic for sunny days. Obviously I don't use them very much. Protection on the knuckle, tiny bit of velcro holding them on. Uh, quite tight these ones, I sort of stretch them in. Uh, make them mine. But yeah, cool summer gloves, literally. This is just driving into Creef, or driving through Creef uh, just now. Creef, C-R-E-I-F. <laughs> I probably spelled that wrong. Just for those who can't understand my pronunciation. Um, lovely wee place. It's quite famous for its Creef Hydro uh, Hotel. I came here on my last Christmas night out uh, last year. Had a great time. Um, I work with predominantly an awful lot of females. <laughs> so you can imagine the carry on that went on. Uh, I'll tell you what. They were hammering on my bedroom door. And I had to let them out eventually. Uh, yeah. Yeah, Creef, it's a, it's a bonny wee place. Screen Larrick is where we're heading. Creef's not a bike, I'll give him an exaggerated wave. There we go, here comes another one. I'll give him a even, I'll give him this one. There we go. And the next one that comes along, they're getting the rock. It's a marvellous thing, the summer and the sun. riding into St. Fillin's at the moment. 
far absolutely magnificent. I've, I've been meaning to say, I've just uh, came from that last place to here, and what a road, what a day, what scenery. I know I'll probably repeat myself, but what a fantastic place Scotland is, it really is. Uh, <laughs> what can I say? Magnificent, you'll see in a minute when we fire in here. Look at that! <laughs> Imagine living here! Well, sort of do, but uh, <laughs> isn't it fantastic? I'm riding the bike with one, no, no, <laughs> with one hand. Uh, no hands. And going down the corner. But, uh, what a place! Now, what they did have here was a bit of modern art. Did a, a silver chrome man coming out of the water there. I have seen it, I passed it, seen it with my own eyes a few times. And uh, I've driven past recently and it's no there. And it seems like I'm making it up or I've dreamt it. So I'm going, <laughs> I'm going to Google it when, <laughs> when I get back or I get a chance. Uh, just to make sure I'm not going around the twist. Overkill there, but uh, yeah, that's how you overtake a car. <laughs> it helps when they indicate left and pull in. <laughs> now heading through the the marvellous Loch Ern Head. So we're heading right to Crean Larrick, and anybody who knows the the roads around here will probably have a a wee guess as to where I'm going. We're in towards Tyndrum. And that's an even bigger clue. So here we are in Tyndrum. And it won't be much a surprise to let you know that we are going to the Green Valley stop. Now I did come here a few months ago and well, I'll let him tell you about that. Depart somewhere else now. No. This part here was usually where uh, motorbikes would be cordoned off. There's a big sign there. The Green Valley stop. Never seen it like this before. The roads aren't that bad. Fucking hell, I mean, the sun's out. What a bloody disappointment <laughs> this has been. Now, it's a totally different story today. Oh, there are indeed lots and lots of motorbikes, which is good, and the sun is out. I hate going to these places just in case I do something stupid like drop my bike or whatever. You know what I mean? <laughs> and everybody looks and goes, Cock! What a cock! But no, no, it's not going to happen today, Brutus. No, no shifty, I'll behave myself. Honest. I'll be good. Well, what a bloody difference for the last time. That hardly looks nice. Do you like that? XR, 1200, I like it. Ducati does nothing for me, it looks like a toy, but yeah, lovely. <laughs> Look at right tit sitting on that, I must say. Uh, the adventure bikes are out in force. I love them. Nice. Uh, more adventure bikes and it's Triumph. BMW. Right, everybody's got their helmet off now, so I'm starting to feel a bit of a dick. So, from me at the Green Valley, catch you later.